Hello, Pauline. Uh, it's nice to hear an email from you. I hope you get your assignment very well and you get a perfect A with my answers. I hope it, it's going to be helpful. So let's start the interview. How old, when you were start, uh, how old was I when I started playing tennis? I was seven years old. How many hours are you practicing tennis per week? I don't play tennis that much. Uh, I, I do a lot more physical work and uh, so I would say I practice 10 to 10, 10 hours a week, 10 to 11 hours a week. Um, how many hours of physical training? So I would say two, two and a half hours, three, and a, three hours a day when I train hard. Um, what's the feeling you've been when you're playing tennis? How do you feel? I always feel excited and it's important to have fun, so when I'm excited, I always play better. Uh, have you been in special schools such as tennis for option? I've never been to really special school like academies. I, I did go to a sports school from 8 to 11 grade. Uh, what's your biggest sacrifice and decision to make a sports career? Probably leaving home, leaving family and you know traveling around the world. Can you imagine your life without tennis? Uh, at this moment, no. But there's been a time that I wanted to do something else, but that moment went, faded away really quick. Um, what would you have done instead? It's difficult to say. I probably would have do something in the sport because I've always been active, always like to play games, and I'm such a competitive person. Um, who? Who brought you to tennis when you started as a child? My mom started to work in a tennis center and uh, I came to see her after school to her work. Who is your idol? My idol always, tennis idol has been Steffi Graf, but I have a lot of uh, idols, a lot of athletes that I really admire and just people in general who are inspirational. What are, uh, was there a moment, for example, as a teenager you said, stop, it's too much? Speaking about tennis, um, as a teenager, I think it crosses your mind, you know, quite a lot of times, but if you have a big dreams, it, it kind of just so small, so, you know, you have bigger dreams than the pain that you have at that moment. Um, what's your life, dif uh, was your life different than your friends? Could you go out at night, go to parties? Well, sometimes when you don't play tennis, you, you want to enjoy your life and go have fun with your friends. But when, when I'm in the tournaments, when I pre uh, prepare for the tournaments, it's always very uh, disciplined. Have you done a diploma next to Tennis Lake University? Yes, I actually have uh, graduated this year from a, from a sports university and I have a diploma. I have a master's degree uh, from the university in Belarus. Uh, which advice would you give to teenager practicing tennis? Um, always have fun. Have fun, enjoy, you know, learn as much as you can and uh, try, to, uh, try to take advantage of the opportunities and really, and really dream big. Um, what do you never forget in your suitcase all your traveling passport? That's something that you will never travel <laughs> without. <laughs> Have you ever been to Switzerland? Uh, yes, I have many times and actually might be there in a couple of weeks. And where do you find your Nike bandana? I'm looking for some, but I have never found one. Well, it's gonna be your lucky day. With this video, I will send you one of mine and I will sign it for you. So hope you have a A, pl a plus grade and uh, have fun in school, learn some more and uh, enjoy tennis. Bye.